Well, hello, 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 my happy match scrappers. It's National Card World. It's not national. Why do I say national? It's World Card Making Day today, and I'm trying to stay on track and just work on cards and and just being creative and being in my happy place. Except I have my daughter and my grandkids coming over, so I had to stop and vacuum real quick for before that because the baby still runs around on the floor, and I have a dog and two cats. But anyway. I, you don't care about that either. Here is, I just wanted to um, bust open all of this stuff. This has been trickling in from the mail since I think Wednesday. The last thing to arrive was my spell binders this morning. And I just haven't had, <coughs> oh God, I'm sorry, a chance to um, open these packages up. And I've been dying to open them. So I'm doing it now. I mean, even this box I picked up, this is the all aboard. I picked that up from my doctor's office. I know it's a crazy place to pick up your mail, isn't it? But my doctor's wife is, and I are very good friends and we're scrapbooking buddies. And she did a big spellbinders order and went ahead and added my stuff to her order. So we just all came at once. So lucky for me, it had just arrived along with me having to go over there to pick up the order to get the x-rays for my ribs from my fall, which showed um, that I don't have a fracture, by the way, because you guys see my other videos I, or uh, crack I have um, at the best a, a hairline fracture and or um, and more than like I just really bruised my uh, my my um, ribs from my fall so it just hurts to cough so I try not to cough and the more I talk the more I cough there you go <laughs> oh my god and laughing is not good either I'm sorry <coughs> Ow. I'm sorry it, I just so I have to stop and hold my side anyway Let's go on. You guys do not want to hear about all the craziness that happens to this mad scrapper. You all want to see what I got in the mail. So let me just move stuff. I'm going to move this down here on the floor. And let's start with what arrived yesterday. This came, this is my monthly club from Spellbinders. And anybody that belongs to the Spellbinders club is well aware of just the insane shipping issues they are having. So I belong to the total package, so I get it all. And this month, I already received an email from them. For one, I received the email that everything was delayed because I'm sure it's sitting on a tank, or part of it is sitting on a tanker right now off the port of L.A. or, or San Pedro or Long Beach. Um, and it's, you know, it's been the news. It's been national news, the pile up of tankers there, and it's not getting any much better. But, um, so I got an email telling them I was going to get all my dies, but that they were going to have to hold off on sending me the card kit. And... And they, not only did they do that, which is okay, cool, that's no, that's smart business to send you an email and say, hey, we're sorry. But on top of that, they credited my Spellbinders account, which thirty eight fifty, which is what the charge is normally for the card kit if you were ba buying it by itself as a member of the card club. And they said as soon as they get it, and they told me flat out, I don't know when, we don't know when it's going to come, but when we get it, we're mailing you the card club anyway. That people is stellar customer service. And and I know this because I'm going to, oh, hang out. You know, I'm going to go ahead and I want to zoom this a little bit, a little bit better. There we go. And I know this because that's what I do. That's what I do for a living. I, I am an immigration paralegal, but that's what I do is I dispense, you know, I help people all day long for the company I work for online and, you know, via emails and via the phone. So I know what good customer service is because I try to do that myself. So I'm like, okay, so spellbinders. Okay. I really want my card kit. But I get it, and I'm going to give them props for good customer for, you know, at least. I mean, that's, that's to me, is stellar. That's awesome. So, anyway, that's just my thing on Spellbinders. And I'm going to remain a faithful kit, you know, card uh, kit member. If you guys have not seen it, you guys have to see October's releases. I, I, I am just like, oh my gosh, please don't let these be delayed because they are amazing. And I think this has got to be my favorite month. I'm just looking at um, the, the the people, the releases, those, you know, like their, their designers who get the stuff early and oh my gosh, and just their release themselves. But <gasps> I'm so, I just, I'm like, it's amazing. Okay, anyway, so check it out. I will link you down below. But check out the videos on YouTube for Spellbinders, the October releases. Uh, they're just fabulous. Okay, I got to remember what I ordered. So what do we got here? Oh, my gosh. Look at the little birdie. This is, so this is the large die of the month. And at first, I didn't think I was going to care for it. You know, it was one of these, it was one of those months I'm thinking, maybe I'll jump out and sign up for a smaller one. But it normally, 
by the time you get several of them, it's almost not worth it. It works out a better deal to do the total package. But I don't know if you can see how cute that, that card just as is, is stinking adorable. Just super cute, but quite a few dies. So it's just a tweet. And I remember, now that I remember this, I know I saw a video. Somebody did a video that really like sold me on, oh yeah, I'm going to get this. And I can't remember now which one it is because I've slept with since then. And I'm not kidding you. This just hit the mail today. My September kit just got arrived today. I'm not going to fault them. I'm just happy it's here. I really, really am. So we've got the just a tweet. So let me see. I'm, I'm working my way through stuff slowly. More slowly than surely. <laughs> but... but there you go, but it's going to see the light of day at some point someday. Have faith in me, okay? Oh, and this one, this is the, I know this is, this is the APG. My gosh, it's huge. I knew it was a, it's a cash register. And then, you know, you have the little sentiment. I mean, and I've seen VNA work this one up. And VNA creates, I'm going to find her video and I'll link it down below so you guys can go look at it. Um, um. It's amazing, and I, I can't get over how big the register is. I mean, look at it. That, that's my hand. It's not like I have a huge hand. This is way big. This is way, way larger than I anticipated. Wow. And, you know, and, and never every month, the, Amer the, the, uh, the APG never fails to please. I don't know. I mean, usually it's Becca Fecan who does them. I don't know if this one is it too. I, I can't be sure, but... Honestly, um, I love it. This is so, so cute that, yeah, it'll be, it'll be added to the pile. I admit it. I'm a hoarder, but I rather have it and wait to be able to use it than wish I had gotten it. So there you go. The next one is the Glimmer Build a Banner. This one, but look at that. So it ties in. This is what I love about their clubs is that they tie their products in with the other things that you get. So it's not like, you know, uh, higgly piggly. So look, we're going to go back to just a tweet. So we have the banners that you can make a lovely, and then you could take the, the flowers from the birdie. In fact, I would put the birdie in there. I would combine them both and make a, and do a slimline card. And that might be the way to go that, because I love those flowers on that black card. Why reinvent the wheel? Can't I just file off the serial numbers and just copy this and go, really, ow, I mean, ow, ow. I mean really, because that's what we do, we watch all this stuff, then we get inspired, I am no creative genius, but I see what others do, and I go, oh, I want to do that, and I have several already in the works of just that, but that is so cool, so we have that, the, and then they always send you a roll of glimmer, so this one says glimmer aluminum, I don't know, it looks pretty gold to me, but still isn't, but it's really, really, that is really, excuse me, I'm so sorry, a beautiful gold. So we have the glimmer tapes. I, you know, I have my glimmer right here at the foot, you know, like right there, right there, right there. It's sitting right there off my, that right underneath the desk. And I need to break it out and use it. And then maybe if I do, I'll really start using it. It's like, oh my gosh, I'm just, I'm, I'm so ashamed of myself as well. I should be. <clears throat> and then we have, oh my gosh. The little, I for, I remember this, a small die of the month, layered mix and match sentiments. Look how cute. I love this. So it has happy birthday to you. So we'll have, ha that's the happy. Um, I'm assuming that's the, yeah, that's the birthday. I have to try to read these backwards. Happy birthday you for the ampersand. And we, oh, see, I could just read them here. So um, there's thank, there's thank. So you can so you can do thank you. There's a hello. There, there's the happy. There's the birthday. There's love. There's the two, and then we have flowers. I I love and you know especially sentiment word dies like these come in so freaking handy. In fact, they would have come in really super handy when I was making the cards for world for cards for kindness for world um, card making day, which is today. I'm filming this today. I don't know that I'm gonna make it up. To get this edited and uploaded today, it may not make it till tomorrow, Sunday, and for that I apologize. But this would have come in so, so handy. And if you want, I'll link you below also to, yeah, to the video that's in the process of uploading. I ha It's going to be two videos, you know, because I had to spread them out because they were long enough as was. 
but I did make 35 cards to donate to Cards for Kindness, and I really, really fought hard to get them up so I could upload these first thing this morning. It didn't happen, and for that, I'll, I have to apologize. It is what it is, guys. If you listen to the video, you'll know I had a heck of a week. I work. You know, I had to take my mother to the doctor's appointment. I fell. I, you know, I injured my ribs. It's been a few days. <laughs> I can't make this stuff up out. Anyway, so we have that. So it would have come in really, really handy, but I'm glad I have them. I will, I'm going to continue making cards for kindness. I'm going to continue doing that because I feel strongly that we need to give. And this is a way that I can take something that I love to do anyway. And like I'm always saying, if I'm going to make a card, I might as well make five. This is how I can take some of the spare cards and just send them off so that they go and make, you know, to be given to someone who needs that little pick me up. So we have that ability. So I highly, highly, highly encourage you to do the same. Let's, you know, let's make this world a better place. One card at a time. The next one we have is tweet. Fr oh, so here is now something that this is new that they were, they're doing now with the scent, the stamps for the monthly stamp club. They were, I think, doing it, making it optional to get the dies now. Uh, apparently, starting in September, they are making it to where you can, it'll be the stamp, I believe, the stamp and die. So that you have the dies for the stamps for the club. If you're in the total package, like I am, and I belong to the Stamp of the Month Club, so I believe they're going to have just the Stamp of the Month Club, and I think the Stamp and Die. I think it's what they've done. They've done an added an extra, an extra club. But if you subscribe to the total package, they're going to toss in the dies. And they're not upping the price. They're just adding it in for belonging to the club. So this was, and look at that. There's a little ornament. This is so stinking cute. So these are all, you can see it better here. I don't know if you can or not. But those are the little birdies again. Just so sweet. So cute. And I am not a huge, huge stamper. We are not going into how many stamps I own, despite the fact that I'm not a stamper. But that, though, but I love them. These are so, so adorable and will make it something happen. Or it might make it into a giveaway when I get my act together. Who knows? Only the shadow knows. We'll see. Let's go to the next package. This is from somebody I'm well aware with. I think this is probably the second time I order from them. This is Maker Forte. They are also the storefront for Hedgehog, Hedgehog Hollow. Super cute stuff. Cute. You know, I, I they do a lot. They're very strong in st stamping mixed media. And that's not always my huge bag of tricks. So I, but I watch them and they happen to be having a big sale. And they're big. And I always check out anybody that says big sale. And they had a bunch of their shaker bits. Like ridiculously cheap. So I ordered their shaker bits. So I got these little jars. They're, well, obviously they're normally $4.49. I think I paid just under 3 bucks. So I think $2.95 for them. So I got all of these little shaker bits that I can use. So here's, I think, on uh, many of them I got two. Some of them I only got one. But obviously that's for Valentine's. I mean, I'm afraid if I shake them out that I won't be able to. But can you see those? Look how cute those are. You guys know I love my shaker cards. So those are my shaker bits for my shaker cards. So that's what I ordered straight out from them. I just about ordered all of what they had. I mean, you know, at least one of each of what they had on sale. I don't even know. Does this screw on? Am I, or is it just me and it just... Okay, we're not going to worry about that now. We will figure it out. This one is... Okay, this is a Halloween-y one because I am going to be making... Okay, I think it. I think I'm just twisting it for. Oh yeah, it's kind of like it's. It's like the pill bottles. So you just have to put it down and and it'll catch again. There's got to be a way. And we're not going to worry about that now. So anyway, forget about the bottle. We're going to open them anyway. But look, these are little tiny spider webs, and I'm going to be making a bunch of cards now for Halloween. I'm going to try to be doing a, do a series on for Halloween, and I got to get crack it on it. Get get going right, Myra. Get going. But those are the lovely little, look cute little spider webs. So I thought those were stinking adorable. So I don't know if I got two or I only got one. We'll find out because there's a bunch of little bottles in there. So now let's see. So, okay, let's put it here. Look! <gasps> I did it. Shocking, huh? Let me take that little spider web and put it back in there. So now I realize there's a little, I just got to pay attention. There we go. Okay, next. What do we got here? We've got, oh, look how cool. Did I order this too or did they just... 
they just send that to me. I think may have, I may have ordered that. No, I think that was a gifty. Look how cool that is. <gasps> a pen. Oh, with the stylus. Ooh. I know. I'm I you know, I'm so easy, you know, with the I love that. Maker Forte. Creativity is my forte. Is that not cool? Oh, I'm a I'm a I'm a happy camper. Yes, I oh that is so cool that they did that. Oh, I love it. Okay, next. Oh my god. Oh, these are bigger than I thought. Oh my god. These are eyeballs. And I think I got two of them, and they're big and they're thick, but look at those. Oh my gosh, look how cute these are. Again, for those Halloween cars. Hello, lovely little eyeball. So I got some of those too. I think, like I said, I, I pretty much, I think, got almost one of each of everything. Now, now that I know what I'm looking for, let's see if I can do the jar again. No, that was a one-shot deal, guys. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to worry about it. Next little bottle are, ah, uh, this was tailor-made for the Mad Scrapper. And this is, I, I just, yeah, I think, I'm positive I got two jars of these. Look at these. These are playing cards. Does that not scream Alice, like Alice in Wonderland? You remember the playing cards? They're all guards. Look how cute those are. So trust me, we will find a way. But aren't these just stinking adorable? I just, I love shaker bits. I'm just like, I, I had to just this week move my box of shaker bits and got, find a bigger storage container for my shaker bits because I have that many now. All right, we're not working about the jar. Uh, more eyeballs. So that, I told you on many of these, I got a second jar on them. This is, oh my gosh, look at these are jack-o'-lanterns. Oh, not again, look. So I have little pumpkins here. So let me spread them out a little bit so you can see them a little bit better. But aren't those adorable? I could probably see them better if I weren't wearing my computer glasses and we're wearing my close, the, my scrapbooking glasses. But there you go. Aren't they cute? So they're little, they're little pumpkins, little jack-o'-lanterns. Again, perfect for those Halloween shaker cards that I am going to make. Oops, now I made a little mess. Let's see, let's pick those up. Oh, I can do that in a minute, or do that later. But I'm afraid I'm going to lose them. And every one of them is precious. I love my shaker bits. There we go. <gasps> Look, I got another one right. Don't be impressed. That's a one-shot deal, I'm sure. More. See, there's a more pumpkin. So I told you on many of these, I got two jars. What have we got here? Oh, these are feathers. Now, wouldn't these be, are there feathers or leaves? I'm not sure which. But regardless, but wouldn't that be so cute with the, to do a shaker card with the, that tweet, the tweet one I just showing you? Wouldn't that be so cute? in there. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm crazy. Never mind. Everybody knows I'm crazy. Or aren't those adorable? Oh, and I, I'm positive. I got two jars of these cause they were s just so colorful and so cute and they spoke to me and yeah, that didn't work either. <laughs> I, I'm just like testing myself to see whether, which ones I could do, which ones I can't. This is another Halloweeny one. And these are, excuse me, bats. <coughs> oh gosh. <coughs> Ow. I'm sorry. Um, bats and I guess green moons, but look at those again for Halloween. Aren't those little teeny tiny bats adorable? Aren't they just stinking cute? I love them. I really, really, really love them. So yes, I went crazy buying shaker bits. I couldn't help myself. It's a sickness. I'm telling you there are, they are flat out my favorite cards to make. That's which is why I make so many of them. Okay. We're not dealing with that lid. We have three more jars. There's no, it's like, no, wait, there's more. Okay. Another jar of playing cards. So I don't have to open that one up. Let's see what we got here. Um, hearts. These are hearts. They reminded me of those little candy hearts you get at Valentine's day, but aren't they the same one? Are they the same ones as the one I already showed you guys? I think they are. So we can stop right there. You guys have already seen them. Why am I peating and repeating? Let's not do that. Okay. Now I have another jar that I have to figure out how to close. And okay. And then another jar of the bats. So that, I mean, I, like I said, this is, this is just what I got from Hedgehog Hollow. I will, I will link you down below to their website. There are, she's just a cool, Alexandra is a, such a cool, cool lady. I really love her. I could, she could sit there and read the phone book. She has that amazing British accent. I mean, she could just read the phone book and I'd be happy. I'd listen to her. But they're not every, for me, you know, for a lot of me, I, I don't do their, but I love the shakers, but the stuff that I love, I love. Okay, next is all to new 
Alternate, this month I belong to their club too, but this month I did not get them because I wasn't a huge, huge fan. Doesn't mean that their stuff is amazing no matter what. If you've ever done their flowers, the layering flowers, they are beautiful. But I, but they had a sale, so I ordered some stuff out of the sale, some of their clearance stuff. So I got, remember I was telling you guys how I know I have the Tim Holtz tag die somewhere? I know I do, I just don't know where. So what did I do? I bought a new one. This was on sale, so I got these. I now I go, oh my gosh, this is getting, this is making me nuts. So I got more tag dies, but this is cool because it comes with the tags in two sizes, and then the same tag, but with the flag already cut in. And then here, let's see, I think these are just regular, probably just regular tags, no, no nothing special on the bottom. But let's <clears throat> let's try to pull these out. Let's see if I can pull this out. There we go. They just because of the tape they put on there. Just so you can see, so there we go. Another tag card and then another regular tag and then two little banners for sentiments. I just love them. So yes, I got them. I'm like, forget it. I'm sure now that I bought these, my Tim Holtz will turn up. But I don't know. I might have loaned them out too. And that, and I'm very, very guilty of that. Ladies, I highly, highly recommend if you're a loner to keep a list somewhere. Make a list and have, keep a little booklet of who you loaned your stuff out to so that you don't find yourself having to replace the stuff you loaned out because you're a dingling. Just saying, just putting that out there. <laughs> I've done it. I have a mint, a mink, okay? My full-size mink is 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 AWOL, and I don't know who has it. I don't remember. So, and that's a machine. That was, my mother actually bought that for me so that I could make my wedding invitations three years ago. So that, you know, more than, and it's not the mink, it's the fact that she got it for me. That's what bothers me, and I've not seen it again. I don't know where it went. I don't know who has it, and it makes me sad that they kept my mink. More, again, because mom bought it for me. Okay, the next one I got is the, um, I got, what are they, they're missing. I am missing, oh, no, there it is, okay. I got the the Easter, it's an Easter egg, but it's called, what is it, there's a word for these, the Pisanka, the, the Pisanka, I, and I'm a Pis, I have no idea, so I'm, I'm, I'm just massacring it, but it's the Russian Easter eggs, the Orthodox Easter eggs that are just, they do this amazing, amazing work making these beautiful Easter eggs, so I got the die set, because I figured, okay, I can use this come Easter, so they had it bundled, I think I got it for like $10.99, the die, I mean the stamps and the die set, so you guys know that's a link. So if it's still out there, if any of these items are still out there, I will link you down below so that you can go run and get them yourself. But I got these because I just I just love them. It really, really spoke to me, and I can do this come Easter time. We have to think ahead. And then lastly, I got this little roll of washi tape, sunflower palette. It just was a cool little palette. Um, and I it, they probably got me at Sunflower because I'm a dingling like that, and sunflowers are my favorite flowers, but it was it looked really pretty. So I got the washi tape. Not that I'm a huge washi tape user. I don't know what I was thinking, really, Cause, because it's like I have, I do have a box of washi tape, and ask me how often I break them. You know what I use my washi tape the most for? To tie the cold down dyes. Oh my gosh, that's, that's ridiculous. Okay, next, Hero Arts. This is this month's, I believe, Hero Arts Card Club. I don't belong to that club, but I watch. I do watch to see what it is that they're coming out with because every once in a while they'll get something like, oh my gosh, I might have and must have. And this month was, no, I'm not going to do it this way because I'm going to slice my fingers open. Let me use my handy dandy Amazon tool from Steve. And, um, and this month was one of those months where I had to get it, had to get it because what was it? What did I say my flower? Were you guys paying attention? Test time, quiz time. What's my favorite flower? <laughs> yep, you got it. This month's kit is flowers. So, okay, let me open that. Let me pull this out, set it aside. Oh, I love that. Thank you for your order. We appreciate it. Yay. I appreciate you guys. Look at that. Look at that. Look how cute that is. I'm going to steal that inspiration because I have. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, see? They, they, they've done double duty. But this is the September Club from Hero Arts. We're going to send fly there. I have to say at least once a video when I'm doing a mail haul, mail call. Fly, my pretty fly. You know what? I didn't say mail call, did I? <gasps> oh, I'm slacking here. Anyway, so 
This is the September Hero Arts Club. So worth it. So happy. Look at that. Look at those beautiful sunflowers. I'm just like, <laughs> so, I mean, it has a hello stamp. I forget what that one says. I'm trying to think. Oh, thanks. There you go. So I can make a thank you card. It has the die to cut out the stamp. You have little sentiments here. I'm just, and here you go. So see, this is what it's going to look like. So they give you the layering. They show you the layering. So pretty. And I mean, I, there's videos out there. That's how I caught up with them. Like, oh, must have this, must have this. And as part of the club, they sent their inks. So I love it. So I have the inks that they use to create this card. Whoa, yay. I have a Hero Arts blending brush, so we will have to try it out and see. I have some blending brushes, I did get them. I have. I think I got those off of Amazon though. Do I use them? I, yeah, we won't go there. And then on top of that, you get the stencil. They have sent the layering, and not just stencils, guys, not just stencils, but layering stencils. So I, they, they sent the full set of all the stencils to do these. So I am going to have to fiddly fart with them because it is the fall. And we always relate sunflowers to the fall. So I love it. And I love how you can you see if I hold, you can see these little holes right here. That's, they line up. So you can just, you know, you line them up and that's how you can keep them all straight. So I love it. I am, ooh, I'm very, very, very. I am, a, I are a happy camper. Love this. I am super pleased with this club order. So it was worth it. And it's not, I forget, is it 35, 39? I mean, definitely under 40. And this is a nice amount of product for that price. I mean, you're getting the stencils. You're getting the stamp set with the dies, with the little, your little brush and the ink. I am very happy that I feel personally that I got value. I got value out of this club. And that's what and that's what it is for all of us. It's not just the, oh my gosh, it's pretty, I want it. But we want value too. So definitely, this was definitely well worth it. Okay, what's the next box down here? I'm going to do, I'm going to skip over spill by and leave it for last. Scrapbook, excuse me, no, this is Club Scrap. Um, I discovered them at the beginning of the pandemic through one of the expos online and I watch what they do. They are a, you can join the club or you can just do, you know, monthly, you know, pick out what you want. So I don't belong to their club because I don't do a lot of 12 by 12s as much lately, <clears throat> but I had to give, I had to get this one. Why? Why did I tell you guys? Did I told you guys what my favorite flower is. <laughs> yeah, that's why. That's why I got this month's club. I had to have it because it has sunflowers. Had to be, had to be. So this poor box, it's a miracle things got here because you look, look at that. This is how it arrived already. It's like, oh my goodness. You know, who took a bite? Who was hungry and took a bite out of the box? But here is my, my club, my club scrap. Let's see. Let me pull that out. Let me set that aside. I love it with these, and I'm, I'm, I'm like the nut job that tries not to tear the tissue paper. Why? I don't know. It's a sickness, so at this point, I'm not even going to worry about it, because this is a seriously sticky sticker. But anyway, this is the, this is, this is the whole package, and every month they have a new, a new kit. I'm, literally, this box is definitely going to get tossed. I may save the, the tissue paper, but this poor box has seen better days, so fly, fly. But this is the car, the the paper kit I got, and this was okay. Sunflower Remix Page Kit. So it was a special release. I don't think this is the monthly. They have a really cool Halloween one, guys. You gotta go look at it. I will link you down below to Cub Scrap, ah, uh, because they came up with a really cool uh, for um, Halloween. I thought it's. I'm I'm still like thinking about it. But I definitely got this. So they give you all the paper. They do a video. So they not only give you all of this, but they tell you how to work it up. So there's a video out there that shows this. So I'm going to find it and I'll link you down below to it, to what to do, how to do the kit. But the paper is beautiful. And again, it's sunflowers. So 
There is no way I was going to miss out on this. I love, love, love. Did I mention I love sunflowers? You know, am, I, am I being obvious? Ugh. And, of course, they give you also all this paper for, I mean, this is a nice amount of paper, and it's nice. It's nice weight. This isn't cheap paper, okay, guys? This is at least 80-pound paper. At least. At least 80 pounds, if not, I'm 100 pounds. I'm not sure, but oh my gosh. Good quality paper. This one's a little bit thinner, but it's still that gold. Oh, like a pre, it's pre, is it just one sheet? Yeah, so it's just one sheet, but oh my, I almost, I want to say it. It wants to feel like a, no, see, there it is. It's two sheets, but still, oh, look how pretty it is. It's, it's really pretty. They have the yellow. So they have, they include all the paper to work the pages up. So I am going to be working this one up because again, it is sunflowers. It's fall. You know, I've been talking to, to Peanut Gallery about, you know, maybe making a foray out to Oak Glen, this apple orchard place out, you know, not too far from us. Um, we also have a trip at the end of the month. My son-in-law is doing a, an Ironman in Oceanside. So we'll be back in Oceanside, but this time I'll be going with the grandbabies and my daughter and my son-in-law. So we're very much looking forward to that trip. And um, his, Richard, my son-in-law's parents, my compadres, are going with us and we've become great friends. So it's really cool. Anyway, neither here nor there. This is the cutaway sheet that we can, I mean, I can either cut this all out by hand or I can use it as the excuse to break out my scan and cut that's collecting dust. That's all it's doing. It must do more than that. And then strips, again, all of these will be used in the pages that they uh, set this all out for you. So all you have to do is watch the video and grab your trimmer. It, they, they, it is so, so simple. And then, of course, they include, I mean, we have all the frou-frou. So we have ribbons, and we have twine, and we have die-cut. Look how pretty. Oh, my gosh. And they're not just yellow. They're cut out of the metallic paper. So look how pretty those are. Those are, I don't even know if they're die-cut or they're laser-cut. They look suspiciously to me to be laser-cut. And although I don't see the little burnt, but either way, really high quality. Really, really well cut out. And then we have sparkly bits, as I call them. We've got little really pretty gems. Look how pretty those are. And again, those will be used on the pages. So I got, what, six of them? Six, seven, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, I can count. I can count to ten easily. I'm safe with that. So we have that. And then we have, look how cute these are. Little sunflowers. Little sunflower and, um, charms. There we go. I can't even speak English today. But we have those, so look how pretty. So I am super, super stoked, super, super happy with this page kit. So I'm just like, I the, this was, I think, the first of the boxes to arrive. And I just, I'm like, okay, I'm going to wait until I wanted to do, I knew I wanted to do a mail call haul here. But it's like, okay, I'm not just going to do it one item. So I'm going to deny myself. i just like, ah, oh, I'm going to just, it's been, so it's been staring at me for two or three days. Easy. Let me squeeze out some of the air and let me not even worry about it right now. We'll just set that aside. I can't believe I got it in, the, in the, that fast. Now, I know what you've been waiting for. You've been waiting for me to bust out this one. And this is a friend made a big order. She said, well, we were talking about it and we were going, well, here, I'll add it to my order. I'm like, okay, great. So she's at this, again, this is my doctor's wife. And that's how I met, you know, it's, 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 it's worked out great. We met at doing tri-community adult education, um, some a video, uh, not video software, but, um, uh, slideshow making software so we met there and we've become fast fast friends and so we got this so anyway she ordered one and she ordered one for me too of the all aboard christmas kit i believe this is still available i'm going to look to be sure i got some extra dyes and you'll see that in here so let me let me grab those did i okay i'm gonna grab her note that was my okay this is what you owe me check which i already paid her um but anyway Let's go in here. I'm going to set these aside for a minute. I'm just going to show you a quickie of this. I mean, this is what comes in the all aboard box. I'm going to do a separate unboxing of this and maybe even actually do something because it looked like that card easily made because all the die cuts come. But I just wanted you to see what comes in the all aboard kit just really quickly. Just look at all of this stuff. It's just a ton of of stuff your paper there's more paper down there we've got look at that that's quite that is a stack of card bases and envelopes and we have die cuts and we all know spell binders does not chintz out on these die cuts these are the dies and guys it makes the tray the die cuts make that train so it's all of those dies 
So I will, I'm going to see if I can find a, one, a magnetic sheet that I can put them on so that they can be spread out easier. But look, we have more, more stuff here, more, you know, twine and more die cuts all, and shaker bits. They always give us, you know, I don't know if they always give us shaker bits, but hello, I'll take all shaker bits. And always, always the include little foam dies and another roll of these tapes. I must have a million of them now by now, I swear, because I belong to the club. So this time they gave us two. So I did want to show this to you real quick, but I'm going to do this. I'm going to do another video with an unboxing and I'm going to try to make something with it at the same time for once. Let me, let me, let me stand true. So we'll see. But I wanted to also show you, these are the, what the other things I ordered along with these, these are all, and I want it cause I want to make Halloween cards. I have got the door, the doors to make this. I have both of them. They both these door are I'm not well, actually not both, but I have more than one door, I think. For spell binders. I actually have an obscene amount of doors. I'm, I've been contemplating pulling them all out and just doing a video just to show you guys that this is a problem. I'm, I have the Anna Griffin door. I think I have a, uh, a Crafter's Companion door. I forget who else I have a door. I have a couple of windows too. I mean, I have one. This is what started me with Diamond Press was their window from last year. I mean, it, it's just, it just hit me when I was going through sorting stuff. I'm like, I have like four or five doors. This is like crazy. <coughs> anyway, so I got these two pieces because I can take that same door and do one for Thanksgiving, for the fall, whichever. I mean, I could do both. Do thankful and or just even leave off the mat and just leave it and do it for fall. And then we have Hey Boo. So we have the halloween -y. So this does the mat, gives me the, um, excuse me, the bats, little skulls a 31 and then this is the window right here over the top and it's a i guess it's a spider web very very cool and here this one it's much more classic looking so i get um the pumpkins that are stackable but not only look at this not only do we get the pumpkins look at that we got the lit the 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 tops that you can cut separately so you can have your pumpkins can have tops love it hate them love it because that means we got to cut all these out and glue and you know it's what I love about Spence Binders dies. And you'll hear me working on these things, muttering my, under my breath. What was I thinking? You know, because, but it's the beauty of what they make. It's what they're known for. It's those little attentions, the details that keeps me coming back again and again and again. And these, I'm assuming, are lips right here to dimensionalize the topiary pots. I mean, they're just, it's just, it's just gorgeous. I love, so I got both of these. And then I picked up, all the spooky stuff, the ghosts, because heaven forbid I don't have enough ghosts because I have a ton of them also from Diamond Press, but I've got all the ghosty guys and another, you know, jack-o'-lantern and a cat had to have the black cat. But look at that. See, that has to be made almost just like that. That is I definitely five by seven worthy, but isn't that cool? So yeah, the only thing that's missing as far as I'm concerned is shiplap or that siding. I want to put siding. So I'm going to have to layer paper to give it that siding look. But isn't that cool? I mean, just everything with the little skull and the bats. Isn't that, they put 13. I don't know if I do 13. I might do 31. I, I don't know. I don't know which way to go with that. But isn't that, well, remember the monsters. You remember the thir monsters? Remember? They used to live on 13 Mockingbird Lane. Do you remember that? I think it's Mockingbird Lane. I have to look it up. Who remembers? You guys remember? Leave me a comment down below. But I remember that. I remember it was number 13. But look at how cute that cat is. You know, put a little white in the background to see, you know, you see the eyes. And the spooks are just, they're all, it's just all adorableness. So I got that. And then this one was the one I was really, really excited about. Is the, and I got one more, but I think that's in my other order that I have from Spellbinders. I have something else, don't I? Oh, no. I know what I do. Wait a minute. That's missing. What happened to it? I am missing a die. Maybe and I was opening these, pawing these in the car because I got the wagon too. I got the wagon. Where did the wagon go? I wonder if it's in my bag because you know what? Hang on a second. Let me find it. Give me a second. Well, I'm back. The plot has thickened because I have no clue where that die is, but I did get the die set. This is what the pump, the, um, the scarecrow reminded me that I got the set that's the, the wagon. I had it in my hand. So it's not like something like, oh, Tara forgot to give it to me. Oh, no. It was in my hot little hands. God only knows what I did with it. So I am sorry I can't show you that. But if you guys have seen it, it's the wagon. And I I, I was going to use the wagon together with the scarecrow. So regardless, let's go through the scarecrow. League. I mean, and, and his cuteness 
knows no bounds. I mean, not only do we have the scarecrow, of course, with the crow that's not scared, but what really got me is, look at that, the corn stalks. I mean, da again, down to the detail, I love them. I hate them. They're going to make me crazy. But look at that, the little corn cobs with even, the, it'll even emboss the little, you know, ridges um, for each kernel. I mean, can you guys, I mean, it's just amazing. Just amazing. It is such a, I mean, even like they did it here with the, and this is glimmer, a glimmer plate all the way around. I believe I might even have that glimmer plate. Um, but it's, it's just, he's so cute so cute and i saw nicole spore do it and oh my god I, I have to have him so i've been dying for the scarecrow to make a fall card because i can still do it so i got him i'm bitterly disappointed that i can't show you the little wagon because it is so stinking cute too and i don't know it'll turn up after this video has been rendered and uploaded you watch mark my words that that's when it's going to turn up but for this, for this mail call and the haul, guys, this is it. I am going to come back, um, and maybe later tonight when I will have time because I have to get, you know, my kids are coming, or my daughter and my grandbabies are coming over. So after they leave, which is my next prime time is in the evenings is where I get a lot of stuff done. I'll work the, I'm going to play with this and do at least maybe one of the easy cards and maybe start working on the train too because I'm excited. And then I'll really do a serious unboxing. But me, I just wanted to show you what the mail brought. I still have a shopping haul, which will be a separate video, and I'll be doing that next. But I wanted to show you what the mail brought me, and there's more coming. I still have stuff that's heading my way. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this inspires you to go grab little things or, or to say, oh, wait a minute, I have something like that. Let me pull it out. That's the whole point in sharing this with you. But more than anything, it's like, oh my gosh, I have to go get it. Go get it now. Um, so if you enjoyed this, obviously, please give me a like, drop me a note. I respond to them. So it takes me a day or two, but I read the comments. I do respond to them guys. And if you want to see more of this, uh, of what I bring to you, you know, like the, the stuff I get in the mail, my craziness, then obviously subscribe and ring the bell. I will be back. My madness knows no bounds. And I think that I have something to say, and there's no stopping me from saying it. So there you go. And meanwhile, guys, have a great day. You won't, I don't know if you'll see this, but I, at this point, not only just have a wonderful world card making day, but let's make it a world card making weekend. Let's have fun doing what we love doing the most. All right. And meanwhile, like here in the crafting corner of madness, we're all a little mad here, guys. So let's scrap the madness together. Okay. Bye.